the outlandish north to south experience concert took place in alliance france accra to bring artists from the northern part of ghana for an experience of their lifetime the concert was also used as an avenue to introduce a new technology developed by a Ghanaian to translate Ghanaian languages into other understandable dialects. Speaking to Nation One TV, Paul Azungwere, an engineer and artist who works in the field of artificial intelligence, AI, explained that the concert was held to help outdoor the app Kaya, which can serve as Google Translate for Ghanaian languages. He stated that the choice of using musical concerts to push this idea is premised on the fact that both language and music are imports as of our culture as people. He added that AI is the technology the world will live on in the future and employed Ghanaians to embrace it. He continued that the new app, Kaya, is beneficial to language development in Ghana. He said the technology can teach how to read and write Ghanaian languages and translate to other languages as well. He advised that infrastructure and systems must be put in place as a nation. This, he said, will reduce the risk in using the technology by preventing exploitation and influx by aliens. See, that, that is be lying to you. And this hypocrite be lying. My name is Paul Azunre, and I am an engineer and an artist. So I work in the field of artificial intelligence, and I work in particular on language technologies for Ghanaian languages. So we have built an app called Kaya, which you can think of as a Google Translate for Ghanaian languages, which handles uh, languages such as Gorne, such as Dagbani, Chui, Ewe, and Ga the kind of languages that we as Ghanaians care about. And uh, a few uh, months ago, um, we decided to hold an event where, where we tried to push uh, this idea, this app, and together with some music, because I am part of a community of artists from the Upper East region of Ghana. And so, you know, language is culture, music is culture. So we thought it might be like an interesting idea to have an event that kind of merged those very important aspects of our lives. Artificial intelligence, as you know, is the future of technology. So a lot of things in the future are going to depend on this. So you know, artificial intelligence can be used to, let's say, manipulate elections or to like uh, attack, you know, cybersecurity um, risks come with deploying artificial intelligence technologies. So we, as a people and as a nation, need to be able to have infrastructure in that area in order to, for example, defend our elections from foreign interference. We need to be able to build tools that enable us to communicate with each other, which is going to create jobs. So you can imagine, let's say, a doctor going for national service in an area they don't speak a language. They are not able to contribute if they can't communicate with the local population, right? But this app enables them to communicate with the local population and to give back to that community, right? So we are talking about the creation of jobs, uh, and we are talking about national security, we are talking about cultural security, and it goes on and on. We need to build an economy for the future, a future-proof economy. Artificial intelligence, machine learning, and those kind of technologies is how we achieve it. I have noticed that uh, we had a very diverse set of artists, but very importantly, we created a lane for artists who are socially conscious. So people who, let's say, talk about issues of bad governance, or issue, uh, people who talk about you know, poverty alleviation, or about uh, confidence issues that we suffer in our society with regards to, you know, let's say, even technology, because they keep telling us that uh, we are kind of inferior, and we are not able to achieve these things on our own. But that's not what we see, right? So I wanted to bring these artists together to kind of show uh, the diversity of the community here. Also, the music in Ghana, right? There's a lot of it. People, uh, a certain kind of music gets a lot of attention, but I think there's a lot more uh, out here. So you saw artists like Kwajo Spiri, who really talk to the socially conscious nature of things. And I just thought it's very important to highlight those kind of artists, but not only them, right? Also. 
you know, like the, the people, like say Rock City or Surabia from the Upper East region, uh, maybe this is, uh, here in Accra, it's not typical to see artists like that perform. And we are a multicultural society, right? Uh, so we need to kind of mix among the different tribes. You saw people speaking so many different languages, which was the whole point. We wanted to showcase the diversity of our <laughs> wonderful society. In modern music production, knowledge of computers is a plus, right? Because the computer programs are the ones being used to compose things and arrange things and process things. So actually, as a computer scientist, I actually have a knowledge that helps me do this stuff. When it comes to marketing, it's also like artificial intelligence, social media, those kind of things. Again, things that like an artificial intelligence person has may have an understanding of. So I don't really consider them different, and in a way, the music helps me be balanced. So I don't think I would be saying. He concluded that up-and-coming artists should take criticisms, but it should not weigh them down. I think you should uh, definitely listen to criticism, but at the same time, keep going and believe that uh, there's a market out there for you, regardless of what the people around you might be saying at the time. If you truly love what you do, and you keep looking for your target audience, eventually you'll find it. So in my case, yeah, I definitely got a lot of pushback when I started making music. That, oh, no, you know, like, there's no for you, go and like, do the other thing and stuff like that. But I think over time I kept doing it and I think I found my niche. And I think there's a niche out there for you, so just keep pushing. On the Twitter, the On the TikTok, the On the three the On Instagram, the Yourself, all right? All the solutions are inside. Yeah. 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 Do you wonder why we cry? Let me tell you why. Looking up to the sky. How many times will we let them commit crimes? While they are supposed to save us, which they pretend to do sometimes. How many times will we realize that other children's crimes are our country? Our efforts dying to play in imbeciles. Is it too late to save it? Is it too late to listen? Is it too late to say it? Me, God, play, train, uh, many problems. I got many problems, many problems. I got many problems. Oh, this is a big Yeah, I'm a big agra. I don't know what agra. Yeah, do my agra. Thank you for watching Nation One TV. Kindly subscribe for more news updates.